Okay, we're going to walk over here. All right, let's do this it. This is something. Did we ever walk in the screensavers? There was Not nowhere to go. From like what? We no, we'd walk in... over to the TV to do fresh gear. <laughs> it was like two feet away. Or we'd walk to the stairs. Well, we got a big set. Pump. Come on, let's. All right, let's go. Let's get a long walk. We're going to let's take do a... it. Oh, I'm exhausted. Okay. We're going all the way over here to the other side of the studio. Wow. May, this is maybe okay. a little too big. What do you no. think? Yeah. No, yeah. it has to be big enough to fit all of our intellects. <laughs> now, That's what I would say. if you saw uh, Survivor, you know Mark Burnett. He's a great reality show creator, very famous. His latest is America's Greatest Makers. It's Tuesdays at 9.30, 8.30 Central on TBS. 24 teams started. They're trying to win a grand prize of $1 million. And joining us right now, one of the teams, we're going to have two teams here today, both of whom have made it to the almost the finals. It's, to the finals. To, to the, the finals. finals. Yeah. The finals is five teams squaring off against each other with one winner for a million dollars. Wow. So we have 40% of the total survivors you betcha. on the show <laughs> here right now. The yeah, <laughs> Studio's got to be bigger. He's doing quick math. John Schaefer is here. He's the CEO of Aseya, along with his wife, Alita Schaefer, who is also with Aseya. Mm -hmm. You guys have two-year-old and a one-year-old at home so say hi wave hi <laughs> mommy and daddy are here on tv right now and uh and so you how did you get involved with this first of all we met in the gym 13 years ago yeah. um and we've been working on different ways to track our fitness and so even fitness fit. fanatics for years to some extent i think it was interesting on the show i kind of make a quip at myself in terms of like i make a joke i've got a dad bod like we've always that's, kinda, that's the new thing that's the, the new thing yeah, apparently it's going to yeah, go I'm out of fashion i've been working soon. on that really but, hard but i think the yeah. thing is 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 we've always been in, out, kind of struggling with it. And when you're looking at a lot of the fitness devices now, one of the big things that they're not really doing for a lot of people is really helping you with the full range of, of fitness, right? You got a lot of step trackers, yeah. which is gets people motivated, gets yeah. them off the couch. But then it just stops being helpful after. I that. know. If I go on a on a to spin or if I go to lift weights, mm -hmm. it doesn't monitor anything. It just you you say I'm doing a weightlift workout, right. and they go, okay, fine, have fun, right. good luck. And so add a. Yeah, and it can take a lot of time, like 70 tests, yeah, just to get one thing to start. Exactly. So that's what is frustrating. This? So yeah. at Asaya, we have made the Delta Glove. And the Delta Glove is a weightlifting glove, but uh -huh. it's smart. So it can track oh. what exercise you're doing, how many sets and reps you've completed, and even what weight the, you've lifted. And that's the big thing. I think if yeah. we want to focus on one piece is the fact that we've worked in with some really smart materials into the palm of the it glove. It can tell how heavy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Holy we'll show cow. you. So we'll give you a So little... now for when you're doing it, you're not obviously connected to anything. No, no. So right now what we've got is our prototype. So these are definitely not on the market yet. Okay. So this right here is kind of the looks like, give you an idea of what it's going to look that's like. That's the final the version. Final form. Okay. The current version that we've got is still relatively small compared. This is kind of the progression. We started with this nice little... It looks like a raspberry glove. pie almost. We threw a little Arduino on Arduino, there. Arduino, okay. It's streaming numbers on the screen. We moved all the way to this giant kind of Iron Man monstrosity on our arms. But all of these were made in our living room. Yeah. So that we is really so cool. like we had our day jobs. We'd uh, come home, play with the kids, put the kids to bed, and then this is what we'd do from like 9 p.m. to 1 a.m. Some this people, was like our passion you know, project. watch The Good Wife. Some people play Monopoly. You were designing. We nerd out. You know, this is cool. cool. <laughs> now, what is a SAYA? Where does that come from? Analyze strength, exercise, and health. Oh, I like so it. So it's an acronym. If you look at the name oh, of it, it sounds like pretty it. and actually means something. Yeah. yeah. And so we actually, I mean, we're, the bigger focus is just on a SAYA now that we've kind of had the acronym. But like, I think it's just, you know, it's short, easy. People can remember it, and and it is nothing really at this point a few people's names here and there, but for the most part, no one's ever heard of it, so it, it's ours to, to play with a little bit. So show us how Asaya works. Perfect. Sure. The Delta Glove. So what we've got is, as you can see kind of on the screen here, we're kind of taking a new approach to what it's going to look like, a really simple kind of bait. Oh. That's gonna be, there we go. So this is the kind of functional screen we're looking at here. We've been kind of tearing it apart a little bit. So you have okay. this on your phone or your tablet while you're working yeah. out. So you can look at it when you're working out, or you can just work out, and, and it will track it and see what you're doing yeah. and look at it later. So, so we have this, like... the pounds that are lifted. So right now it's blank, but it just recognized oh, five pounds. Look at that. Wow. He's That's got five very pounds. amazing. Okay. Um, sets. So sets are this inner circle and reps. So it counts as reps. There's how a little can bit it of know a how heavy right that is? In terms of the data that we're running our current algorithms, also. They were all captured using this glove just on me. So we're on a pretty limited data set. That's the other thing is we have to make this work for everybody. And yeah. yeah. And so that's where we're going to be doing. There you go, 20 there. pounds. And so that's we're going to be do doing a round of fundraising to be able to get this into people's hands so they can actually, you know, works. Do you want to crowdsource it? Would that be the goal? So after we have more 
we want to make right. sure that we're not going to kind of betray the trust of our early customers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so a lot of people did a, jumped on the crowdfunding bandwagon, which is great. But you're not close enough to really justify right. the so money people would give you. Yeah. I understand. Okay. And we don't want to we don't want to piss them off. We like you no. guys. We Aren't want we, you to buy. I like it. We, we want to respect you. No, too many people do that. I think they that's do. great. They yeah. do. When we have our bill of materials ready for the manufacturer, we'll have a Kickstarter then campaign we'll a or Indiegogo or something. We'll have a campaign where we know we're going to get the product when we promise. Well, and right now, of course, you you've already won a hundred thousand. Dollars, yes. America's greatest right. makers, we have. and you're on your way perhaps to a million dollars. So awesome. that would help a lot. With that would. Right. That it would. Well, as I mentioned before, we both like had our day jobs. Well, winning the hundred thousand, Jonathan has quit his day job, I have and so time. he's working on this full time. So we're making leaps and bounds now, which is fantastic. It's, it's been cool. it's been it's been really cool. And the show itself, I think the really cool thing about the show, and you, you'll get to meet one of the other contestants in just mm -hmm. a moment, is the collaborative nature of the show. Yes. It, it really is. I know a lot of people you know, talk about the maker community and stuff like that, but there were contestants on the show who were in each other's hotel rooms at night using each other's mm -hmm. equipment to fix their stuff. That's neat. It's oh, not right. cutthroat. It, no, it wasn't. Even it was... <laughs> in the finalists, like with yeah. the five finalist teams, people were printing things for each That's other. Neat. Like yeah. it was yeah. very much a collaborative That's process, really which is the maker movement. Yeah. Which is really cool. So. Yeah. Help no, us get where it's at. No one gets voted off this island. <laughs> awesome. All right, that's Team Asaya, and that keep watching for the Delta Glove. You finished the show, so they know who won. They do. We're not going to say anything. No, we won't ask, it's, and we won't. Yes. It, no, Mom's no, the they've word. signed papers Absolutely and all not. sorts of stuff. But we want to keep uh, our kids. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That, that would be really a shame if you had to lose that. So thank you, John and Alita Schaefer of Asaya. Absolutely. Now we're going to go over. So Right. And meet Team Grosh. Team Grosh. Hello, Hello. this is Ethan Shore. Welcome. Hi. Hi, Hi, Ethan. Big fan. Thank you. <laughs> nice to have you. So, Ethan, tell us about this because your whole thing is about a, a toothbrush. Grush is short for the gaming toothbrush. You know, uh, if you have kids, maybe you were a kid once, kids don't like to brush their teeth. And so, we created Grush. Mm -hmm. Now, Grush is a connected toothbrush. Grush has motion sensors, so it can detect any movement during brushing. I'm going to show you. I'm going to. This is cute. It looks like a game too. I'm going to brush little Leo this. here. Uh oh, little Leo needs it. Oh man. So you see here, when I go left, brush goes left. Right. Wow. Back teeth. We have a very accurate algorithm, so the brush knows exactly where it is in the mouth. When the kids are done brushing perfectly, it uploads to the cloud so the parents can check and they can see exactly how well they brush and reward the kids for proper ah, brushing. Ah, boy, that would be the best and worst oh, thing that ever happened to my nine-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, that is amazing. Thank you. Do you think your nine-year-old would do that? Would it, would it be a motivator, you think? I think she might, yeah. I think she might because it's like it's a chore for so many kids. You know, adults we say I can't wait to brush my teeth. I can't wait. I know, wait. I know, yeah. And for kids they just it just feels like it's work, work. Work, work. So you have more than one game too. You have different kinds yeah, of Yeah, we there. have several games. So that was Toothy Castles and you battle your way through a different castle every week and you you gain rewards. We have Toothy Orchestra and uh, you know, we're thinking about doing an MMO, multiplayer. Okay. This seems pretty far oh. along. This mm -hmm. is more than just a prototype. Yeah, yeah. Like. So we've made a lot of progress during the show. I think with Intel and the great thing about the Intel Curie module, not only do they have the pattern matching which helps us to really locate where the brush is in the mouth, but during the show they provided us with mentors, industrial design mentors and also development mentors to really you know rapidly develop the product so you have to calibrate this thing somehow right how does that work uh, does it just does any kid just it's simple there's a starting position okay. so you see here when I press the button it doesn't start it knows when it's in the starting position now it's vibrating you see? oh so it won't even do anything it's yeah exactly right it's, it's wow. relative to the wow. starting position wow this is virtual reality backwards <laughs> sort right. of right this is yeah. real reality it is. I don't know if I can handle that. I don't know. I'm a little scary. Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> how much will the Grush sell for? The Grush now uh, for kids is fifty nine dollars. Okay. And you know, I think in the future our vision is a sort of smart bathroom. If you imagine you're standing on a smart scale, you have biomedical sensors, you have a smart mirror, and so it's giving you a lot of information about your general health. Ethan sure is the chief futurologist with Team Grush, and as as with the, our previous guests, you've already made it to the yes. final yes. round. Yes. Hundred thousand yes. dollars. What what is next in the show? I mean, how I mean, do you guys have to battle it out in a pit, yes. or what is so? Uh, what what happens? <laughs> standing for, on one foot without right, eating. Right. As they select the now. top five from, it's called the make or break round. There's 15 teams. Yeah. Three teams go in. Only one team is staying, Yikes. and the rest are going out. They've already selected three out of the top five. They're gonna select the next two, and then Yikes. we'll have the hour long finale for one million dollars. Wow. 
And this is exciting. Is that about just it? so <laughs> nerve wracking though to stand on that floor where it's lighting up? Because they mess with you. They send the reds up before you get green. They, Under well, your feet. They, they, they mess with you, and the thing is that it glows. There's a little curry module that glows, and if you stare at it, it can, can kind of hypnotize you a little <laughs> bit. So you'll see a lot of times when, when we when we pass, well, I don't even your know excuse, it. Huh? I, yeah. I have some kind of, it's like when you watch Pokemon, you get a seizure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's just, just red, green, yeah. red, green, red, green. Exactly. How okay. fun. Oh, I got to watch the finales. That's exciting. So again, that's America's Greatest Makers, Tuesdays, 9 30, 8 30 Central, TBS. And good luck to both of you yes, guys. Yes, good luck. I want you both you. to win. I want you all to win. But you've already won $100,000. Yes. So I guess that's pretty good. That's Congratulations right. to both of you. Thanks for being here. Thank you. With the Delta Glove and Grush. Grush.